Hey man, how's your day been? Good question. I mean, overall my job, my relationship, my financial security and my health, they're all going great. But I can't help but feel just a little bit sad. You know, I suspect it's because I formed my core beliefs about myself in an adverse childhood and no amount of success will ever change that. Kids, man, they can't look at trauma objectively. So if something bad happened to me, I couldn't just shrug it off like an adult and just be like, hey, that's messed up. Instead, I looked at the world like it was a just place. And my childhood brain said, that bad thing happened to me because I deserved it. My brain just decided a long time ago that I deserved pain, suffering and sadness. This feeling that I'm somehow a magnet for rejection and negativity, my brain didn't just feel it. It took it on board like a scientific fact. And now I'm an adult and I don't have any evidence that I do deserve pain, suffering or sadness. In fact, I have evidence that I deserve the opposite because objectively I have the opposite. I have a great life. There's a lot of people here who love me, but my brain, it's, it's made up its mind. Instead of accepting the new theory that maybe I could deserve happiness, it decides to cherry pick evidence to prove its original hypothesis right. It ignores anything good in my life and obsesses on bad things, like this morning when a guy yelled at me in traffic, or last week when something messed up happened at work. And my brain's just sitting there all smug like, see, see, I told you I was right. Look at you, trying to be happy. Nah, man, you gotta trust me, I'm the very smart and very correct brain, so these two bad things are all we're gonna think about today. So now you ask me how my day's been, and I feel three things. The first, I feel like anything good in my life is temporary, like it's all gonna come crashing down in the near future. Because, as I've stated, I feel like I'm not worthy of happiness. The second, I'm paranoid that my brain is going to cause this crash. I'm scared that it's going to sabotage my life just to show me that my first impression of the world was correct. But the third, well, I feel conscious of this whole process. And surely that's got to count for something, right? Surely the first step to fixing something is understanding why it's broken. And I don't know. I guess that gives me hope. You're not too bad. You? Yeah, pretty good. Yeah, that's the way. Yeah. Hmm.